walkthrough. Hello again, it's us. And I say us because I'm joined by my two sons this time around. Um, we're back at it, playing Emily's Away. Um, if you watched the first couple of videos, then you kind of have an idea what the story's about. It's kind of one of those, like, uh, basically it's one of those choose-your-own-adventure storybooks. Walking Dead. Um, yeah, or similar to Walking Dead. Um, yeah, because some, 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 some of you out there are probably like, books, what's that? But yeah, it's a long time ago, there was, well, I wouldn't say a long time ago, make myself sound old. Um, there was these little storybooks, basically. They have them nowadays, too, because I've seen them around lots of places. And basically it is, the story, it goes, you read a section of the story, you come to a junction, and you get to choose uh, a decision. Choose a decision. You make a decision, and then you turn to the page that, that you made the decision. And you just continue on with your story, so... Uh, it's basically the same premise as with, you know, the Walking Dead series and anything with Telltale. So, yeah, so here we go. We're on Chapter 3 now. Um, from the last two videos, basically, we've been talking to Emily. And she's dating this guy. And so I still don't understand it, the relationship between the two. I don't know if they're... Well, obviously, the guy likes her. I, mean, I don't know if she likes him back or if they're just friends or whatever. But um, it's gotten interesting. So let's see what happens. Hey, check out my YouTube channel. So now we're a sophomore in college, <laughs> and we get to change our, change our icon again. Ooh, the Incredibles. No, look, it's Green Day right there. And so, so let's see here. So. Uh, I, oh, matter of fact, I didn't even notice we can actually go back to the very the first ones we had before. Hey, it's, it's cool because when we were a senior, we had these because obviously you can see senior, senior, senior. And then 2003, which we had the kitty cat. So 2004. So now we have the actual panda. Ooh, go back. And as a matter of fact, let me make a, a quick correction here. A uh, last video, I said this was a panda. I don't know what I was thinking. It's a koala. koala. So yes, I do know my animals, I promise. Hey, look, I think it's your but yes, now this definitely is a, a, a panda. And this is a bear. It's a bear. And this is a little bunny. And this is a tiger. That's a liger. Maybe? Tiger? Tiger? Anyway. And so here's the movies. Basically, there's always been sections. There's animals, movies, and musicians. 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 I can talk, I promise. Uh, Incredibles, Mean Girls, Saw. Uh, I don't like... Well, I love the Incredibles, but everything else can... Um, what is that? I don't know what that is. Anyway. Usher, Dr. Dre? Dr. Dre. Yeah. Yes. I don't know. Uh, Green Day. Let's go with Mean Girls. So we're going to go with... Um, uh, we're going to go... I'm a burr. My bear. bear. Alright, let's get on with the story. So, we have more friends now. <laughs> you know, and then I never thought to... Oh, she's talking oh. to me. There she is. Hi, Hi, Emily. Um, I have a buddy list. You know, I never noticed it before, so I don't know if we're able to talk to other people. I mean, it doesn't let me talk to anybody else. So, it makes no sense. I mean, because we have all those friends, but we only talk to Emily. Oh, that person Which is case. fine. Oh, what is this? Oh, Emily's profile. Hmm. Oh, she likes Muse. Oh, I like her already. Yes, I like Muse. No. Well, I did, that's new because that wasn't there before. I'm trying. Apparently, she has updated her profile. So, okay. Hey, Manny. So, we will go with Emily. Hey. And type. Emily. Please tell me you've broken up. How is life? I feel like we haven't talked in a while. Yeah, it's whatever. I'll um, be every day. I'll be every day. Pretty boring. It's good, actually. It's Thanksgiving, and we're fixing to, we're fixing to have a little feast here, and so, yeah, we're going to be fat and fluffy and fall asleep. We have no fun because I have to play a game together. How's yours? It's really hot. Yeah. Stove. I see it's fine. Got any plans this weekend? She always asks me if I have plans. Why don't you just come out and say, hey, let's do something. She always just wants to know what I'm doing. Um, warehouse party, going to a show, hanging out. Technically, to be fair, we are hanging out in the house. Technically, yes. Going to a show, warehouse party. Hmm. That sounds... Let's lie and say we're going to a warehouse party so she thinks we're interesting. We are interesting. Very interesting. Warehouse party. Going to secret warehouse party with my friend. Yeah. Oh. No, okay. See. Oh. Now this is awkward. Yes. Because <laughs> I was thinking, yeah, maybe we'll invite her, but um, then she'll be a third wheel. That's not good. Really Unless it's 
and you can't change your uh, you can't change your choice once you fine. once you made it. So. Well, who's Emma? Uh, a girl I like. Just a girl, just, just a friend, okay. just a girl. It was the same the same situation with with Brad because the guy she's dating is Brad, and Brad at first she thought he was annoying, but he kept on bugging her, and apparently she thought it was brave of him because apparently he was telling her how he feels about her. So. Yeah, um, and so yeah, um, so now I have a friend apparently that I, I have no clue who it is, and so just a girl, a girl I like, a friend, so I'm going to go with just a friend, I have no clue who Emma is, is it Emma Watson, because there was Harry Potter on here, so maybe it is, secretly, that would be maybe awesome. Maybe just a very, very long person. <sighs> so my friends. Bye -bye, she says, oh. Oh, she says, Hermione, oh, cool. cool. I think I've heard you talk about her before. Um, no, no, well, that's news to me because I don't even know who that person is. How did you two meet? Um, who in the hell is Mike? I have all these friends that I have no clue who they are. Um, I met her in class, I'm guessing, since I am in college. So, I mean, it makes sense. Maybe she's in my class. Maybe she's my lab partner. We did science together. Okay, so you're talking way She's too much for me, sure. An engineering student just like me. Yeah, See? That makes sense. That makes sense. Engineering <laughs> student. So do you like her? Oh, of course, the question. Um no not really, because I don't think know who about she this. is. Think about this, girls are crazy. If you say one thing, they're gonna think something. Girls are crazy, is that what you um, said? Um <laughs> Okay. You just lost all your girl viewers. Yeah, yeah, sorry with ladies out there that are watching this. Um, specifically the one that I do know is watching this. Yeah, my son, he's he's ignorant, so but he'll learn. He'll learn, I promise. No. Um, so do you like her? I I don't even know who she is. So I'm gonna say I don't know. I actually should say no, not really, because I don't know who she is, so why would I like her? I mean, obviously she's my friend, so I must like her I'm just gonna say I don't know. I don't know. Oh, I don't know, maybe, I guess. That makes sense. That yeah, makes a lot of sense. That's what usually guys say. We're indecisive. I don't know, maybe. What did she say? Wow, man. Wow, man. like things are going really well. That's just so great. Hmm. Hmm. Subject change. Subject change. So how is everything? Do you want some candy? No, I do not. Oh, wait. What are those? Are those pet? Uh, what is it? Spree? I think so. Oh, my God. Those are so good. <laughs> Pardon this interruption. Wow. Intermission. Wow. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, they're sprees. Um, so we'll ask her how she's doing. It tells everything. Um, everything kind of sucks. Uh oh, oh, that's not good. Oh, they broke up. Ah, uh, what a jerk. He was a jerk. I knew he was going to be a jerk. He was a jerk to begin with. He was a jerk while they were dating. And now they're, he's really a jerk. I want to say good riddance, but that would be mean. So I'm just going to say I'm sorry, because I'm actually not sorry, because now it clears the way. Uh -huh. Wait, so are you? That's, a, that's the dumbest thing you ever ask. I'm so lost, so what are you trying to do? Are you trying to get with her? Well, basically when the story started, it seemed like we were, we were friends. And it seemed like he liked her. And it seemed like she liked him. But then the next chapter basically started dating Brad, this guy in class. Right, right. And it seemed like the guy wasn't very happy about it, but what could he do? And so now he has a friend, and now she's single. Imagine that. Gotta love it. So is this like on different time periods? Mm hmm. It's on? like a year has passed every time we talk. Oh, okay. So that makes more hmm. sense. I just been really long, you know? Mm hmm. Hmm, well, I'm here for you, because I told you I would be, no matter what. Mm-hmm. Hey, thank you for that. I just really feel good. Thank you for the... <laughs> playing the part. Um... I don't know if we want to keep her talking about the situation, or if I want to change the subject so she doesn't feel so bad, so... 
But sometimes people need to get it out, so we're gonna just ask. You should break up. So I'm just going to say, please don't cry. I'm sorry. No, I'm going to say I'm sorry because I'm the one that brought it up. You're amazing. You're amazeballs. No, I'm, I, all I can do is just press the button and it automatically types for me or untypes for me. Yeah, it is lame. I wish I could. Yeah, I wish I, I could type out responses, and but, you know, that would be go beyond the program, I'm sure. Yeah, you know how much programming you have to do for it? You're not a mess. Why did girls do that? You're just sad, and that's totally okay. It is. Nothing wrong with crying. It helps. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. It's nice to be able to talk about this. I haven't really had a chance to vent yet. Wait, See, it helps. It helps. Well, of course. Mm. I know you do the same. I know you do the same, too. Yeah, well, of course. Uh, yeah, I know you. She would do the same. We're friends. She'd be mm. like, nope. Nope, she's deleting the typing. I want to ask you something about a friend you hate me after. Oh, wow. Uh oh. How would you want to hate me? I can never hate you. Well, as long as you're not going to ask me to tell me that you've murdered somebody, then no, I'm not going to hate you. But, um. Promise? Just say I promise, because you don't know if it's going to be really that bad. I can say I, I'm gonna say I could never hate you because hate is a strong word. Just like whenever I asked her earlier when she if she loved him, she even said hey love was a strong word. So we're gonna go. With, I could never hate you. Now if I played this by myself, then I would understand where this is all coming from. Mm -hmm. Like life goal simulator. <laughs> life goal simulator. Yeah, Travis is probably senior year. Uh huh. <laughs> remember how we got boy went for that walk? I don't remember that actually. We stopped at the for a bit. Apparently we did. Can we just lay there and look at the stars? Yeah, that will win. Well, what it was? <laughs> um. I can only play ignorant because that's what most. Most guys are like that because we just don't know because sometimes, you know, there's missing mixed signals and we just don't know. Wait, pause, were they dating at guys, that time? No, we were just friends. No, with Brad and her. No, he, she was single but Brad was bugging her and she thought he was annoying but mm. it wasn't until later on that I found that she told me that he actually was telling her how he felt and she thought it was brave of him. That's why she kind of started liking him. And so now she's saying that... Because apparently this is the same time that she met Brad too, so... If she met Brad, and she was thinking like that about me, uh, I don't know. She seems like she's kind of indecisive. Oh, why didn't you kiss me? Hmm. I, well, at the time, we were friends, and so, even though I liked you, apparently, I so I would say I didn't want to screw up my friendship. I would have known, then yes, I probably would have kissed you. I wish I had kissed you. Mm, I wonder that too. You should have told me. You should have told me. There's so many what ifs, what ifs, what ifs. Unfortunately, we you can't say what if is not real live thing. like that. Just kind of, kind of go and see where it takes you. Um, you should have told me. No, you don't tell girls that. You should have told me. Because basically, they say, well, you should have known. Just say, I wonder that too. <sighs> yes, I wonder. I wish. I probably would say I wished I would have, because if I would have gone had, had known, I would have. So, yeah. Because I know, I, from what I, I gathered, I had, he did like her, so he probably would have if he would have known. Okay, before you say that, oh, never mind. I was going to say, 
Well, you can't change your you can't change your decision once you make it. Hey, I have an idea. Uh oh. Maybe we could visit this weekend. Okay. I'd be really used since I'm away from the school, and we would always say we miss each other. Yes, we have. What do you think? As long as as it's just friends, not a good idea. Please come visit. No, come on. Yeah, he, of course he wants to see her. We ain't seen each other in three years, so yeah. Okay, the person you play as must be really brave. Oh, that's because I'm playing that person. I know, so but like even brave. though you're just the person typing it all, uh -huh. you should have a lot of courage to be able to type that and just send it without not rethinking. Well, that's why you see the person it, like when you press in the button, it automatically deletes some of the things he was gonna say. He changes his answer sometimes. And of course, I would love to see her. Oh man, no, I'm really excited. Yay, she's happy again. Oh, what about your plans with Anna? Um, since I have no clue who this person is, I can ditch her. I can ditch her. That's kind of rude, though. I don't want to make up an excuse. I you don't make up an excuse. I'll talk to her about it. Too. I'll talk to her about it. I'll and tell her about it because I haven't seen you in forever, and you're my friend. Too. And yes, honesty is the best policy. So yeah, we'll talk to her about it. I'm sure she'll understand if she's really my friend. You talk to you about it. I saw me face that. Okay, I just don't want to mess things up, you know? Nah, we're just friends. What do you want to do this weekend? Um, hang out in my dorm? That was boring. Not really. Go to some parties. Well, parties might sound a better idea because she needs to get out. She's sad, so we want to cheer her up. Some stuff around campus. Which would be, uh, I would imply that to be in school stuff. So let's not. She wants to get away from school. Um, I'm guessing she's not. Parties. We're gonna do some parties. I'm she's not the kind of person to go study and stuff. And, well, who knows? Definitely go to some parties. Have some fun. Sounds good to me. Shaving my alcohol. Um, I do not condone drinking, so no. <laughs> we don't need any. Um. Yeah, your option is. We don't need any need to have fun. Come on. We don't need alcohol to have fun. We have each other. No, you know what? Now I'm gonna make it myself. Okay, I'm so excited. I finally came and visited. Okay. But I'll see you this weekend, okay? Of course. Talk to you. See you soon. Oh, that means the chapter's gonna be she over. Has to run, but she's still gonna type in. She's not gonna see it until like tomorrow. It, oh. I gotta type for you, I gotta type. That's me, that's me. Hi! Is away. She's gone! Bye! Wait, what? That's it? That's the end of the chapter. So, interesting, interesting. Hmm, change of events, change of events. So, yeah, um, hmm, chapter four. Story's getting good. Brad, you're a jerk. <laughs> You don't know what you lost, buddy. Yep. Anyway, well, um, we'll continue this really, really soon. Um, I don't know. I'm starting to like this. I mean, it's it's a pretty straightforward game. I mean, it's a pretty simple game, obviously, if you watch the video. Not much as far as graphics is concerned, but it's story driven, and I, I'm a person that loves a story. If you have a good storyline, it's so much better than beautiful graphics and whatnot. I mean, you want something that's gonna get you involved in the game, and this kind of sort of does that. I mean, I wish there were more options to to do other things as far as interactions with this person. Um, but whatever. It is what it is. So anyway, um, thanks for watching and come back soon so we can finish the story. And, and again, happy Thanksgiving!